up guys, Awesome Nerd Show back again doing another another unboxing and it is Loot Crate. Um, so the theme for this month is speed because I've got a need for speed. Um, that was the first way. Anyway, so it's speed, so it's going to have cars and all the fast sort of stuff. Um, so, where to start? So I guess we'll start with the shirt. And so it looks like it's a Tony Stark shirt, at least from what I could see. So you have Stark Industries Motor Racing, um, number 11 there, so I assume that's just supposed to be racing. I don't know if it ties in with Iron Man 2 or not with the racing scene, but um, that's still pretty cool. It's a nice um, shirt, and it actually looks pretty decent for once. And it's a Gildan shirt and stuff, so this actually may be a wearable Loot Crate shirt. It's a um, going to probably be the first one ever. <laughs> um, next up we have, it looks like something, Batman. And it's from QM, so of course um, the partners with Loot Crate and stuff. And it is a Batman metal Batwing keychain. So uh, Batwing is of course his like helicopter, and so it's hard to get with the light and everything. So it's just a uh, looks really cool. I don't know if this is from a certain movie or what it is, but it looks really. Ow, it's got a lot of sharp points on it. But as you can see, it's got some thickness to it and stuff. And of course has the you know the cockpit and everything and then there's things on the bottom and stuff. Of course you have the Batman logo there. So that is really cool. Like I said, a lot of sharp points. So I definitely wouldn't advise putting that on keys unless you want to stab yourself with it. Um, but next up, oh this probably like this one. It's a gone in 60 seconds car, and it's just like the um, supernatural one we got from an old box. Hello. And so this is a uh, yeah, Eleanor. It's a 67 custom a movie star Mustang, as you can see there. So that's really cool. Of course, from the Gone in 60 Seconds movie. Um, and it says, <laughs> lock your car or it may be gone in 60 seconds. That's kind of cool. I've never seen the movie, but I know it's got Nicolas Cage in it and stuff, but that's still kind of cool. Um, next up, we have a Titans vinyl, which is kind of um, cool. And it's uh, a Battlestar Galactica ship. So I may take this out because it's hard to see, but it looks like it's a Cylon Raider. Um, and that's all it really says. And it's just an exclusive, so I assume for the just loot crate. Because all over the box itself it says it's exclusive, and then also has the loot crate thing and stuff. So I've never had any of the ships from um, Titan, but there you can see it looks like the Cylon head there and stuff, and then of course has a ship, and it looks like it's got damage and everything. And it does come with a base and um, like a little thing you can sit it on and stuff, so it actually is like up in the air, it looks like it's flying, so that's pretty cool. Not a big Battlestar Galactica fan, but that's still really cool. Um, next up it looks like we have a hood ornament. Oh, uh, that's cool. And so you can either get arrow or flash, and of course we got flash. The arrow looks a lot cooler. Um, of course, I don't know if you could really put this on a car, or if you just have to have a certain um, thing. It is a cheap plastic, so it would be easily broken. It's hard to see, but it, um, if you do look at it close, you can see like the flashes, um, you know, little lightning bolts on his head and stuff to tell it is the flash. Then on the back here, it says flash, but with this material, it's hard to read and stuff. Um, but it looks, I assume it's probably a magnet on the bottom here, so you can just stick it to any thing really. But that is really cool. Like I said, the arrow one would have been a lot cooler just because um, of the look of it. You can tell it's arrow and everything. But the, um, still really cool. And of course you can put it on a really old car if you have it to do that too. We should put it on your car. Yeah, my crap mobile. Um, it looks like the last item we have is the pin, and it says, uh, it's a tire, and it says loot year on it, of course, with the whole good year thing and stuff. And then the, the 2016 speed is the theme. And then, of course, we have the book, and this time it's not a glossy book, it's a, like, actual paper. And then, of course, I probably won't do it in here, um, but the box makes one of these vehicles, and we have the green one, you can see. And it says, eat my dust, of course, on, for the license plate. Um, let's see if there's anything else in here that maybe we could get different. 
So it doesn't really look like it. Of course, there's another um, advertisement for the WWE Slam Crate, which hopefully is coming out, I assume, this next month, October maybe. Um, but really looking forward to that. Um, but yeah, that looks like, besides the hood ornament, that was the only difference. And then, of course, the box and stuff. So that's going to be it for this loot crate this month. Um, what was your favorite item out of this, bro? Oh, I'm going to say the Cylon uh, ship. Cylon ship. <laughs> Um, I don't know what my favorite is. I'd probably say it's either this Flash Hood Ornament, just because I like the idea of it, and it, of course never seen it before and stuff like I said. would have been cool to get the Air one, but I really like this shirt as well, just because it's something, um, superhero related, um, but it's not, like, over the top and, like, only, like, you know, fans or whatever. Of course, everyone knows the name Tony Stark and stuff, um, but it's, uh not like over the top like superhero type stuff so it's really cool and the shirt's actually good like i said so i'm um, excited to actually get a wear loot crate shirt but i think that was a decent box this month i mean when i saw the theme of speed you know i'm not big in the cars and stuff so i thought it was kind of you know not good or stupid or whatever um but i thought the items were pretty decent this month so that um was a good month for Loot Crate, I guess. Um, so that's going to be it for the unboxing. Be sure to leave any comments you have down below. Subscribe to see more, and we'll see you next time.